That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. It was Neil Armstrong's famous words in 1969 that inspired dreams of further space travel. But in the decades since, trips to the moon stopped. Now, US President Donald Trump wants to see NASA return to the moon. We will not only plant our flag and leave our footprint, we will establish a foundation for an eventual mission to Mars. Lunar lithologies that are not represented in, Half of in NASA's estimated nearly $20 billion budget is designated for space exploration. This week, scientists from America and Europe met to discuss how and when future missions will happen. If NASA is to send astronauts to the moon, then the people in this room will probably have some involvement. They hope by going back to the moon, they can push space exploration to the next level. Scientists say only a fraction of the moon's surface has been explored, and robots and telescopes can only learn so much. We can say, OK, here's something I want to do on the moon, and we can design an instrument to do that. Um, but, and this has been demonstrated during Apollo over and over again, is that having a human on the moon finds new things that you didn't design for. I was strolling on the moon one day. Harrison Schmidt is the last living human to walk on the moon. He's inspiring a new generation and believes it's America which must lead the way in a crowded international space field. Well, it's primarily important for the United States and the free world that NASA uh, return to the moon uh, because of the uh, international competition in space. And uh, the forces of freedom need to be there and be, uh, be competitive. Do you think the world can get excited again about another mission to the moon? Oh, there's no question about it. The world's going to get excited anytime human beings are taking huge risks, uh, managing those risks, and doing exciting things. Private companies such as SpaceX have opened up space travel, and NASA plans to work with them and other countries in the future. Three, two, one. 45 years after Apollo 17 left the moon, NASA hopes it can send humans there again within the next decade. Harry Horton, CGTN, Washington.